With custom tools you will be able to generate some customized Excel report. So here we have the Excel report that will be generated for that assembly with the whole assembly structure. Those reports can be customized with custom properties redefined in custom tools and also properties of SOLIDWORKS, for example the quantities or the item number. We also have a preview of the document. Items can be excluded also from the Excel report. And then I just click here export to generate the Excel report. So this Excel report here is pretty much out of the box in Custom Tools 2013 and it can also be customized with your properties. So as we can see we also have a preview of the document inserted and all the defined custom properties. Now we'll also show you a different Excel report that can be generated, so it's a bit more advanced. In this report we have a combined information retrieved from SolidWorks and also from an ERP system. For example here we have the supplier that was retrieved from the ERP system as well as the cost information. We can also have, for example, um, insert preview of the part and its drawing, for example. So we can also have link uh, to the file, so for example this could be very useful with the custom tools viewer for non work users to open and view the documents. And here we have a different page or so like generated with, the, uh, with custom tools where we have a bit more information from the ERP. So also the spare part, for example, if they need to be ordered. And those reports could be used, for example, to generate spare part listing, drawing listing or uh, cut list, item listing, any kind of report can be customized.